Today, we are going to compare two popular cameras, the Canon R100 and Sony A6400. We are going to take a look at their features, who they are for, how they perform in various use cases, user experiences, and which one is the right one for you. Links to both of the cameras will be listed in the description below. Let's get started. The Canon R100 and the Sony A6400 are two digital cameras that were officially introduced respectively in the 24th of May 2023 and the 15th of January 2019. Let's take a look at how their specs compare to each other. We tested both cameras to assess their performance in different scenarios. Let's take a closer look at our ratings for each of them. Here are our ratings for the Canon R100. For portrait photography, we will give it a 7 out of 10 rating. For street photography, we will give it an 8 out of 10 rating. For sports photography, we will give it an 8 out of 10 rating. For day-to-day -day photography, we will give it an 8 out of 10 rating. For landscape photography, we will give it a 6 out of 10 rating. Here are our ratings for the Sony A6400. For portrait photography, we will give it a 7 out of 10 rating. For street photography, we will give it a 8 out of 10 rating. For sports photography, we will give it a 8 out of 10 rating. For day-to-day -day photography, we will give it a 8 out of 10 rating. For landscape photography, we will give it a 6 out of 10 rating. Next, we will take a look at some sample photos from the Canon R100 and the Sony A6400. Keep in mind that these photos have editing done to them, so the result from your camera might be different. Let's start with the sample photos. Here are some sample photos from the Canon R100. And here are some sample photos from the Sony A6400. Next, let's take a look at what other users of these cameras have to say about them. Here's what people have to say about the Canon R100. Great camera, takes amazing pictures. Only downside is that it didn't come with a memory card. I've been doing professional video and photo work for over 20 years and have owned several Canon cameras, but this is my first R-body system. The camera comes with a RFS 18 to 45 mm f4.5 to 6.3 is STM lens, one battery, battery charger, camera strap, and basic setup instructions. The camera has a nice lightweight body with a matte black finish and a clean and crisp LCD monitor. The navigation menu is easy to navigate and the dial on top offers several shooting modes. The image quality is excellent and the autofocus is fast and accurate even in low light. The video quality is good, but the rolling shutter is noticeable. The camera has Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connectivity, and the battery life is acceptable. However, the lack of touchscreen and headphone jack, as well as the glare on the LCD screen, are drawbacks. Overall, I think this is a great entry-level camera with high-quality construction and good picture and video performance. I can definitely recommend it. Here's what people have to say about the Sony A6400. I am very pleased with the quality and functionality of this product. The size and features are excellent. This camera is perfect for beginners like me. It's small, fast, and takes amazing pictures with a cool tone color. Highly recommended for everyone. To conclude, here are our overall ratings for both of these cameras. Canon R100. We will give it an overall rating of 8 out of 10. Sony A6400. We will give it an overall rating of 8 out of 10. 